All right, so everything with electricity falls on, on this right here. If we change any one of these, it's going to have an effect on one of the other ones. Does that make sense? So just if you're having trouble when you get to word problems and it starts talking about this stuff, you just need to be able to interchange one of these words with one of the other words. So if you end up with, for example, talking about volts, you're like, ah, I can't remember what's happening with volts. Think of it as electrical pressure and see if that fits, or electrical push, or electrical force, or change that with the words potential difference, and it starts to help break it out for you so you can understand it. Sound good? So this guy lied to me. I tried it one time, but not really tried it. One, they say, like when you're doing working on electricity, they say, one, two, um, 120 won't kill you, 220 will. 120 can definitely kill you. Well, I got shot well, 120 and I got Good. Good. <laughs> uh, that's good. Um, I don't even hear what Mark here. That's a story. Okay. <laughs>